we're here at Moy on the Highland Main Line carrying out a bridge replacement. We've went for a disruptive possession here, which is 78 hours, due to the timescales and the complexity of the bridge replacement. So the structure you can see behind us, um, we've been building that throughout the summer in an offline position. That allows us to construct it in its entirety without impacting the infrastructure. We're utilising specialist equipment to drive the structure into its final place. Here today we've got people from right across our transport sector, we've got um, highways, we've got a Rail South team uh, and we've got a Rail Scotland team all pulling together to, to get this bridge into place. Later on next year, sometime about October, we've got a, a big, big SPMT uh, pre-box build that we've got in Birmingham which we want these guys to help us with, so you know, coming up here and getting that relationship, building that support and understanding how they operate and seeing what they do is, is great for us and we can share that knowledge and bring them into what we're doing. Great team of guys working well together, you know, Rail South are up there supporting the BAM Scotland which is great. Great to see that alignment, that integration to sort of build them into great delivery teams. So we've got a great team here from Mamut who are operating the SPMT um, trans to transport the bridge in. A lot of commitment from everybody to, to get this bridge into place. We're midway through our 78 hour possession on the Highland Main Line. Um, we've suffered uh, winds, gales, 80 mile an hour gusts, snow, ice, rain, all seasons uh, in the first half of the possession. But we've now got the structure in place and we're now loading in the, the wing walls and lifting them into position. While our focus has been on this main structure to the south, there are two smaller culverts that have been installed and there's been a lot of hard work there that's very exposed, open on the hillside and they've faced some very challenging conditions there and what they've achieved over this weekend is fantastic so the culvert team have really pulled together to get those culverts in. Great to see the bridge in place and to see the first passengers back on the Highland Main Line.